Hey guys, I want to go through yesterday's trading on the Euro USD because it was uh, uh, annoying for me personally and I had some bad luck and I want to talk a bit about the role of luck in trading. So we start the day at 2, um, you can see here, this is the start of the day, we have a setup, touch the Bollinger, lower close, higher close, um, the entry here is 49 and the stop loss is 53 and a half. So that's four and a half for five. So 49 less five is 44. I had this trade um, and the target should have been hit, but you can see the low here is exactly 44. Um, and I didn't get a, uh, I didn't get a bid on my target and was stopped out. So on the baseline, this shows a win, but I personally showed a loss. And this left me feeling annoyed, like I was legitimately annoyed. I was like, ah, oh, fuck, point one of a tick, motherfuckers. Okay, and so anyway, moving on. So we have uh, um, we go into decreasing volume, go out of decreasing volume. We have a hammer candle completes the retest concept. Um, most of the people who are trading this got a win here. Um, for some reason on IB, it was like a half, half a pip extra range, and I just missed out on the target, which so um, I'd had bad luck twice in a row, and now I was feeling like shit. I was like wanting to make it back. And so the system was two from two and I was down to, the system was up 2.2R and I was down 2R, um, which was very, very annoying. And uh, um, we had an, um, um, we are in decreasing volume from this bar. You see, we have the lowest close in the trend on an uptick, lowest close in the trend on a downtick. So in this bar, we're going to decrease in volume. So this is a setup that we skipped, which is good because it would have been the loser. Painted a shooting star, which didn't quite touch the AEMA. So that's no trade. Then we have this one. Touch of the Bollinger, higher close, lower close, but we're clearly in a downtrend at this point. Like, like definitely in a downtrend. And the target was all the way up here and it was too far. So I didn't think that was high and tight. Some people did think it was high and tight and took it. Um, they got a win. I didn't get a win. Um, and so I'm down two after the day. I have this one here. Little sneaky shooting star. The target was right here. So uh, uh, I got a win. So it's back one R. And then we have this one. That's the Bollinger. Higher close, lower close. And another win. And then... Little sneaky shooting star, look at the confirming evidence. We're trending down on the five, down on the ten, pull back to moving averages. And on the five, it's less clear, but um, we're still trending down. We, um, we're still trending down. And uh, so this one painted another sneaky. So my point is. After having two unlucky losers, I got uh, one, two, three quick winners to make up for it. So anyway, that's all I'm going to share.